You are very brave. Because today you are beating a policeman and a lawyer. <laughs> what does it feel? Uh, it was um, a good race. Uh, again. <laughs> I, uh, it's incredible for me. I don't know why <laughs> it's happened in, uh, in this moment, but uh, it's sweet. A very sweet victory. And as far as I can remember, you made your first World Cup start here in Holmenkollen two years ago, finishing number 61. Yeah, it was my first World Cup two days ago in, in Oslo. I was uh, 61. Now, today I'm, I'm one in the same way. It's incredible. Um, again, uh, I'm so happy. I, I make a bet yesterday with my uh, shooting coach, and I say, uh, you will see tomorrow, I will shoot 10. So, today I'm, I'm happy at this. From what you remember in this arena two years ago, how do you like this new stadium? Yeah, it's uh, beautiful. Uh, a lot of um, work, and it's, uh, it's so nice to, to ski here. Um, you know, I win in uh, Oslo and Mankolen is uh, incredible. It's Nordic, uh, Nordic tempo. So, perfect. And still you are in your first season with the grown-up men. Uh, yes, it's my first season. Um, um, I don't know. <laughs> Today it's, it's only great. I, I take a pleasure and it's, it's good. You have no respect for the grey hairs? Uh, can you repeat this? No respect for those people with grey hair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I, I, I respect a lot uh, Christoph. Uh, he is uh, today a uh, yellow bib and uh, I'm uh, so happy for him. And uh, I hope uh, it, uh, it will be a, a good fight with uh, Emil Jensen until the end of this season. And, uh, it's good to be uh, a bit uh, informed. Christoph, you present yourself on your home page as I am sympathetic shooting star. How can you beat this upcoming boys? I'll do the third one. Third is good. Yeah. Pushke? Yeah. I didn't I didn't say that. You wrote it. Okay. I didn't wrote that. <laughs> Who did? <laughs> but yeah. I tried to be funny. I tried to be calm and concentrated, and not to focus uh, beside the tracks. And, yeah, let's stay relaxed as much as possible. Uh, life is life is serious enough. You work as a policeman. Do you handle traffic? Of course. How do you like the traffic? Every, every, every Monday when I come home from competition, I have to <laughs> the traffic. How do you like the traffic situation here in Holmenkollen in the new tracks? Yeah, uh, the only just uh, the only traffic that I have is uh, when I come home, and this is in my sleeping room. There's traffic. <laughs> <laughs> no, I <not> like uh, <laughs> just a joke. Uh, no, yeah, I love uh, I love the famous home and home. Uh Yeah, it's a, a lot of tradition, a lot of history, and I uh, was. I'm really proud and it's always a pleasure for me to be here and, and, and see the crowd and see the famous home come and the, the champion hills and, and of course the new stadium is absolutely amazing and yeah, maybe I should go on the cross country world championships next year to be here. You like the entrance to the new, to the shooting uh, range? Of course I do, I do, I do, I, I like every, everything here and uh, it's really nice to uh, between the races to go out on the 16.7 uh, kilometer loop and, and yeah, it's uh, so different to middle Europe, a lot of, uh, lot, of uh, lot of loops and good possibilities to train and uh, everybody's running around when I was here on Monday, a lot of about hundreds of girls and boys were skiing all over the hill here and that's amazing. Thank you. And you can continue on your banana while we are waking up with Maxim. Come here, Maxim. 
explain your season so far. You have been from number 85 on the sprint team, also so, and up to today. На самом деле, действительно, этот сезон, олимпийский сезон был для меня достаточно сложным. Причем потому, что был в нескольких шагах от пьедестала много раз, и действительно что-то не получалось. Сегодня это получилось, и я очень рад, то, что заняло второе место, то, что справился со стрельбой и неплохо пробежал. Я очень доволен. И постараюсь удержать этот э, темп, удержать эту форму.